Hi folks, today we're going to talk about the Automator SB5-2 Carbon Pile Tester. This is a carbon pile tester that can test batteries up to 1600 cca, which means that the SB5 can put a load of up to 800 amps on that battery. Some of the key features of this tester is it's got a safety unloader. So what this means, when you crank up current, you let go of the knob and it automatically returns. As you may have heard there in the video, so far when I crank that up, we do have a cooling fan for cooling the carbon piles on this. This tester also has a built-in timer. So when you push that button, that light is going to stay lit for 15 seconds. This is important because when you load test a battery, you want to make sure that you load test it at half the CCA for 15 seconds. Also, please note that your battery should have a static charge of 12.4 volts on it at the time of testing or higher. So when you go to test your battery, we're going to push the timer. We're going to crank this up to half the CCA. This battery is 1150 CCA, which means we're going to go up to 575 amps. So we're going to hold it steady right there. We're going to watch the voltmeter. We want to make sure that this does not drop down below 9.6 volts. And if you can see the LED just went off, I let go, and we're done. This battery is considered a good battery because it maintained above 9.6 volts with 575 amps applied to it for 15 seconds. Regarding the loaded test voltage during testing of the battery, uh, generally we speak of 9.6 volts. Something I want to show you here is 9.6 is, is kind of a standard. However, that is actually at room temperature. So when you look at this chart, which is on the side of our tester, you'll see 9.6 is all the way over here at 70 degrees. So if we're testing a battery at 30 degrees, 9.1 is actually an acceptable test voltage. Keep in mind that any time that you're uh, checking a battery with any kind of tester, such as the Autometer Carbon Pile Tester, you want to make sure you're using the correct adapters. You do not want to connect the clamps directly to the threaded stud. That's not made to carry the load. So in this case, Autometer carries specific adapters for you to connect to the battery for proper load testing.